Hey, what's up, you two? Welcome to the Dream Green Show. And for all the new subscribers, I'm Zeke. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos. So I did something very big today. I made a very large purchase and I actually sold off on one of the companies that I've been building up to get 100 shares of. I, I completely sold off of that company and bought thousands of dollars worth in order for me to start performing cash secure puts and create passive income every single week. So as I dive into this video and explain to you guys what company I sold off and which company did I purchase with the money I made in profits from the other company that I sold off, make sure that you stick all the way through the end of this video. I'm going to explain to you how I'm going to generate passive income with this one move that I made this week. But before we dive into it, this video is brought to you by Weeble. Sign up now by clicking the link down in the description, deposit $100 and receive three free stocks valued up to $1,600. So that's, that's pretty much passive income right there if you guys just sign up using the link down in the description. But enough talking, let's go ahead and dive straight into the video. Welcome back dreamers. I'm gonna pull up a quick screen recording of what I did this week. Now, what I did was I sold TNA. It is a triple leverage company and, and I was going to perform cash secure puts on TNA because they paid out such sweet premiums and it was gonna generate me lots of passive income every single week from doing cash secure puts on TNA, but it is a triple leverage company. And if the stock market falls, it's gonna take them a very long time to recover. And I'm just not comfortable if I am assigned 100 shares of TNA of holding on to that for the long run. So I asked myself, what company am I comfortable of holding 100 shares of? And if you're a follower of this channel, if you subscribe to this channel, then you already know that answer. And that company is AMD. So I bought a little over a thousand dollars worth of AMD added to my portfolio and, and it's inching me closer to almost having 100 shares of amd for me to start collecting premiums on amd so i could generate passive income every single week so let me go ahead and pull up the screenshot to show you guys exactly what i did all right so here we are on robin hood this is amd amd is at 79 dollars and 78 or 79 dollars and 21 cents uh it's been declining over the last couple of days so i've seen a great opportunity for me to try to pick up amd this is TNA, I had 73 shares and I'm currently up $102. I was up around $200 earlier, but TNA fell a couple of times over the last week. So this is me, I'm about to sell every single last share that I own of TNA and I'm setting a limit price so I don't lose much money while I'm selling these um, shares. I'm setting the limit price. It just changed on me. I'm setting the limit price to $36.18 to try to get it fulfilled immediately. And it's not gonna up me by selling me the shares at $36.17. So here me selling at $36.18 and it should have went through immediately. And there it goes, 73 or 73 shares have been sold. And now I'm gonna take the $2,000 that I have in TNA, I'm gonna go over to AMD and purchase um all of my cash right back into amd so i did make a profit on tna i was up 100 dollars so that was a good move that i made i wish i would have sold it earlier because i was up around 200 dollars. but here we are amd hit set a limit price and then i'm going to type in 79.28 to try to get an extra penny out of it and then hit continue number of shares i'm able to buy is 33 swipe up and it should have gone through there it goes 33 of 33 shares so i just purchased 33 more shares of amd and now i have 85 shares of amd <laughs> and my average cost is 53 dollars and 99 cents okay so that that was earlier today let me go ahead and pull up my live account right quick all right, here we are on AMD. I now own 86 shares worth of AMD with my average cost being $54.26. So I'm around 14 shares, just 14 shares away from me only 100 shares of AMD. And let me show you guys what I'm gonna do once I get to 100 shares. I'm gonna start collecting premiums by option trading. So what you'll do, you hit trade, trade option, and now that I have 100 shares, you want to click sell call. I mean, I'm obligated to sell 100 shares of AMD at any of these prices above. So let's say I click the 76.50 call. 
That means if AMD go up to $75 or $76, I'm going to collect $1.12 for every share, which is 100 shares. When you option trading, it's automatically 100 shares. So that's $112 that's going to get credited directly into my account. And if it goes up to $76.50, it will sell my 100 shares. So I, so I would have made the money from me going up from $74.82 all the way up to $76.50. I would have made that profit and I would have made another profit of $112. But if it stays below that price, then I would have just collected $112 and continue to hold my 100 shares. And that is me collecting passive income every single week. Now, if I would did this call early on Monday, all of these premiums would have been at a much higher price. Like the further you go out, let's go out a month from now, that same 76 uh, call is now $340. So the further you go out, the better the price is. Now I do have a strategy that I'm gonna use. Let's go out two weeks. And and I like it when the delta is at negative three or right under negative 0.3. So let me show you guys exactly what that means. Here we go. Let's look at the 77 call. I'm gonna click that. And then you click the limit price. And right there at the bottom where it says delta, it is at 0.39. So that's a little bit too high, a little bit too risky and i want it to be right at 0.3 so let's go to 78 dollars that's 0.34 still too close and let's look at this one the delta is 0.26 that's too low that's too low let's do 78.50 all right there it goes right at 0.3 so 78.50 would be my call for it to expire in the next week or so which will if i was to do this option right now 126 dollars would get credited to my account immediately and my 100 shares would be locked up until november 13th but let's look at back at november 6th for the weekly ones let's look at another delta of 0.3 there it goes that's too low at 70 all right so 77 so 77 would be a 0.32 delta. So that's kind of close. And I will collect this trade right now, which is only four days out. I like to do them seven, five to seven days out, but this one's only four days out, so $95. And it's a win-win situation because if the price goes up, I mean, I made money from AMD. And if it doesn't go up, I mean, I made $95 from AMD. So let's say I did this one every single week, $95 every single week. Now here we go, we're gonna multiply $95 times 52 weeks. That is $4,940 that I will collect on the year. That is almost $5,000 I'm gonna collect in premiums as everything goes well in AMD. If I am executed uh, one of those options, I'm just gonna do a sell put option on that and collect those premiums until I eventually get back my 100 shares of AMD. So this, now this is called the wheel strategy. I'm gonna talk about this more in depth in future videos. So make sure that you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out on that strategy that I'm gonna explain on this channel. So $5,000, that is an incredible gain. That is, that's like giving yourself a raise at your job, $5,000 every single year. That is insane. And then, and then eventually I could accumulate 200 shares of AMD and do it and make $10,000 the following year. So this is a strategy I'm going to do and I'm going to track and follow. So make sure that you don't miss out just by subscribing to this channel. So there we go, dreamers. That was my major move on the week. I'm a, I was very excited to make this move. I got rid of TNA. There's nothing wrong with TNA except for that it's triple leverage. They pay, they pay awesome premiums, even more than what AMD was paying, but I love AMD as a company. I don't mind owning 100 shares of them for the next five, 10, 15 years. I don't mind owning that company. So I'm going to collect premiums and create passive income by using the real strategy on AMD. Let me know down in the comment section what companies are you guys using to use the real strategy or what companies are you guys using to collect premiums on down in the comment section but other than that make sure that you guys hit the thumbs up button it helps out my video tremendously helps out this channel more than you can even imagine but yeah other than that i'm zeke bringing you the dream green show and i'm out peace